being able to put together all of the information from um, lectures where we're talking about the procedures, we're introducing them to anatomy, we're talking about all of the sterile processes and procedures that go in. And we transition it into the lab where they actually get to learn it in action. And it's just amazing when you see them get in here and thrive. I want them to go in confident. I want them to be able to scrub just about any case they get thrown into first, whether it's a vascular case or an orthopedic case or even a craniotomy. One of the reasons we try to keep it so lifelike in here so that when they get out into the field, they're not stuck in a position where they're like, well, I have no idea what I'm doing. So I'm gonna make it as lifelike as I can in here so that they can have that confidence going out there that they can do whatever gets th thrown their way. It's not just maintaining sterility, which is a big part of our job, making sure that people don't contaminate your field or contaminate the instrumentation. It's also anticipating the needs. In order to anticipate the needs of the surgeon, you need to know the case and the instrumentation. So we're not just teaching them one specific skill. What we're doing is we're building like a little domino effect so that by the end of the program, they're comfortable with all of the skills that they need to combine to become a good surge tech.